lovely ladies. My name is Kelsey, and I share fashion content here on my channel called Stylize You. The other day when I was scrolling down Instagram, um, I was very excited to see a free trial for Banana Republic Style Passport pop up. So I immediately signed up and was very intrigued to see what it was like. When I went into their website, there was a decent amount of variety on there, and you are able to pick up to 20 items and put them in your closet. You have to have at least eight for you to be able to start the service. Um, once you pick at least eight items that you really like, you can add some of them to your favorites and you will get a mix of three of those items that you picked. So the items that I went for were this beautiful top here. It's a light cream color and it has a bow tie collar that I thought was very um, elegant, very feminine, and that pleating carries on down the front. And the sleeves are slightly ballooned, a little bit, not very much, and you have a button closure down here on the bottom. The only issue that I found when I was picking out some of the items like this one was that they did not have my size. So usually I'm a small to a medium and all they had available was an extra small. So I added that to my closet and then I was very surprised because I didn't know that once you add things to your closet, they'll immediately start preparing a box for you. When I got this, I was like, oh no, I ordered an extra small, I hope it fits. It did fit, um, it was just a little tiny bit tight. But again, that was my error because I didn't know exactly how the service worked. But coming back to this blouse again, the fit is really nice, I would say. It probably is a little bit big for an extra small, so keep that in mind if you're trying out this blouse on Style Passport. And then the bottom hem is just slightly curved, just a normal blouse. The material is 100% polyester, so if you are irritated by synthetic fabrics, that's something to take into account if you are interested in running this particular blouse. And the way I would style it, I will show you now in the try-on clip. selected I actually added into my closet and then when I was going through and doing an edit of my closet I took it out of my closet but by then my box was already being prepared so when I got it I was actually very surprised I usually don't wear anything animal print um, but I do really like the print on this and it is let me get up and show you it is like a leopard print and I like the colors in it it's a light cream and like a caramelly color with a little bit of black. So I really like the colors. They were um, very well suited for someone that has like more warmer skin tone like mine is. And it is a midi dress. It has a pretty high scoop neckline, straight fitted sleeves, and it's fitted through the midsection and then the skirt is a little bit looser so like an a-line shape and it has a small slit that comes to just above the knee on one side at the bottom which you'll be able to see better um, in the try-on clips um, this again is 100 percent polyester so fabric you know eh, not that great and it definitely feels like polyester if you know what i mean not really scratchy just I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> it just feels like polyester. But I really like the fit of this dress. It's very comfortable. Um, if you're someone who, like me, really likes to wear dresses, and I wear them even at home instead of loungewear, or a dress like this is a really good option for you because it's very comfortable. So not so impressed with the material of either this one or the blouse, but I knew that when I added it to my closet that they were going to be polyester but I really like the fit of the dress. The way I would style it is...
And the next item that I got is something that I was really excited to get. I wasn't sure whether I was going to get it or not when I added it to my closet. So I was very excited to get this. And I love the colors in this tweed. Let me try and show you. It has um, a lighter blue and then like a navy blue. Some cream colored threads going through it. And it also has like a silver kind of sparkly thread going through it. Actually, I don't know if you would call this tweed or is it boucle? I don't know. If anybody knows, please let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> so, um, I really like this blazer. It is half, like, partly lined. And the fit is great. It's not too boxy. It hits right around, like, the hip height. So not very long. I wore this with the off-white knit skirt. And I really liked it. One good thing about Style Passport is that they do dry clean your clothes for you. So you don't have to worry about cleaning them. Um, you send them back the way they are. And they will dry clean the clothes for you. But having said that, this blazer I think did shrink some in the arms when it was clean. Because um, it hit me like, like around here which is a little short. Um, it was a little uncomfortable being that short. And I don't have the longest arms in the world, so that was a little annoying. Um, something that you could wear for work, to go out. Not that any of us are really going out that much right now, I don't think. But <laughs> if you have any Zoom meetings for work or etc., this is, I think, a very pretty blazer to do that with. Let me show you how I would style this. Well, viewers, I hope you enjoyed those try-on clips and that you got some inspiration for some outfits of your own. Overall, I really enjoyed trying Banana Republic Style Passport, and I thought it was kind of fun to be able to try some clothes that I didn't have to buy. And yeah, I think I will enjoy doing some more um, rental trials from other companies. I think Banana Republic's fee for their Style Passport is like $75 a month. You don't have to pay for shipping or when you do the return of the clothes. So I think potentially it would be good for somebody um, who works in an office job, maybe needs a variety of different outfits, but maybe doesn't like shopping <laughs> very much. I know there's a lot of people out there that don't really like to shop. So that gives you a more limited selection of clothes when you do the rental. Uh, you don't have an overwhelming amount of things to choose from which might be good, like I said, for someone that doesn't really like to shop. So yeah, I hope you guys liked my review video of this service. And if you liked the video, please hit the thumbs up. I will be doing more fashion related content. If you enjoyed it, then please consider subscribing. I'll see you guys later. Bye.